guys was just filling up all the dog food containers um, and I thought I would make a new video for my frequently asked questions playlist. Um, I get asked a lot what I feed my boys. I do have, I think, two older videos on my frequently asked questions playlist sharing what I used to feed my boys quite a while ago. So I'll be deleting those and replacing it with this new updated video. Um, I have two dog foods that I purchase for my boys. I have seven mini schnauzers um, and six of them eat this Hills Prescription Diet Digestive Care ID Low Fat. Um, if you're new to the channel or new to mini schnauzers, mini schnauzers are very prone to pancreatitis. Three of my boys have dealt with that in the past, so they are on a strict low fat diet. Um, and then one of my boys, Miggy, uh, just a little while back had a problem with struvite crystals in his bladder. So we have him on this, um, uh, Royal Canaan urinary SO moderate calorie dog food. Um, we went with this one for him um, because this was the lowest fat. Uh, my vet researched um, the different prescription foods and this was the lowest fat we could find. So this is why he's eating this one and he doesn't mind it at all. He loves it. Um, it is uh, a 13% maximum fat. So a little higher than the low fat that I feed the rest of the boys. This one is 6% uh, minimum fat and 9% um, max fat. So like I said, Miggy is not one of the ones who ha has ever had pancreatitis in the past. So he's doing really well with the Royal Canaan. Um, yeah, so all my dogs love the food. I know sometimes when people have to switch to a prescription food, they have a problem with uh, their pets eating it. All my boys um, love the digestive care. Eat it right down. I, I don't think my dogs have ever hated a dog food or dog treat. <laughs> I don't think they have. Um, so, yes, yeah, so this is what I'm feeding the boys right now, along with low fat um, snacks like green beans, blueberries. Um, I have found a couple treats that are very low fat that I feed the boys. And maybe I'll do a separate video on those treats that I, low fat treats that I feed them. Um, yes, they all do really well with their dog food. I do boil up um, chicken breast, uh, take all the fat, uh, all the skin, everything off of the um, chicken breast and I boil it, no seasonings, nothing. And then I shred it up and um, sprinkle just a little bit on their dog food. When I feed them lunch here, I'll add a clip of what that looks like, of how much uh, chicken breast I sprinkle on their dog food. So that also helps and gives them a little bit, because chicken breasts are very low fat, gives them a little extra like a topper on top of their dog food. So I will share that when I feed them their lunch here in about an hour. So these are the two dog foods I'm feeding the boys currently. Okay, everybody's uh, patiently or impatiently waiting for their lunch. <laughs> yes, everybody's waiting to eat. Um, I got everybody's food uh, in their bowls. Um, as you can see, I use slow feed bowls for six of my boys because they eat way too fast. Grant is a good eater. He eats slow, our oldest boy who is right here. Um, so he just has a regular dish and then I got my, I have two kitties in case you're uh, new to the channel. Um, I have their food over here too. So I use a different color bowl for Miggy. I also have it, uh, his name written with Sharpie marker on his bowl in case I need someone else in the family to feed them uh, breakfast, lunch, or dinner if I'm not here. Um, since he eats a different kind of food that way, they don't accidentally give his food to one of the other boys. So I just use a bright green bowl so everyone knows that's Miggy's food since he eats a different food. So um, I feed them, like I said, three times a day. And I feed them one third a cup at each feeding. And then I sprinkle the top with just, I mean, just a little bit of shredded chicken breast. I give the kitty some too. Um, just a little bit of shredded chicken breast on top.
So, all right, let's get these boys fed. They've waited long enough, they said. <laughs> all right, everybody's happy now. Everybody's happy they got their lunch finally. <laughs> They're like, stop talking, Mom, and give us our lunch. <laughs> So yeah, so the slow feed bowls help with, um, before I started using the slow feed bowls, since my boys eat so fast, they even try to eat real fast with these slow feed bowls. Sometimes my dogs would eat their food. A um, uh, couple minutes later, um, throw it all back up whole because uh, they were eating way too fast. So that has helped tremendously. Um, they do not do that anymore, thankfully. Um, so yeah, so that's why I use slow feed bowls. But So I hope this answered a lot of your questions um, on what I feed my boys. If you have any other questions about it, you can leave them in the comment section below. And I will talk to you guys again in our next video. Bye guys.